Beer, bear, beard, beer. Beer, bear, beard, bird. Beer, bear, beard, bird. So I was trying to challenge myself and say these words a little bit faster, but they feel more like tongue twisters. Um, the vowel sounds with the R's make it a little bit challenging and they all sound very similar. So in today's tutorial, we're going to uh, learn to hear the differences and pronounce these vowels and R sounds a little more clearly. So stick around and hopefully by the end of this lesson, you'll be able to say beer, bear, beard, and bird clearly and easily. So as we first look at these words, we notice that the spellings are very different. Even for the words that have the same sound like beer and beard, we have the vowel sounds i, e, and uh, and the consonant r or er. Now the consonant r affects the sound of these vowels and it's what we refer to as R-colored vowels. And so, of course, I'm teaching these words from a standard American English pronunciation style. So if you've learned British English and you say the R differently, that's fine, no problem. All right, so let's get started with the first word, beer. Now, it rhymes with the word ear. So the vowel sounds are somewhere between the E and the I. Okay, we kind of hear them both. Uh, we also hear them in the words clear, near, fear. Now you can see our chart, our vowel chart here, and you can see E and I are high front vowels compared to the rest of the vowels. So your tongue's gonna be raised a little bit in the mouth, your lips are gonna be a little bit tense when you say this word. And then next we have the consonant R, or er. So you can see our chart here. When we make the R sound, you're gonna curl your tongue back just a little bit. Curl the tongue and then round the lips, push them out a little bit and round them. Er, er, okay. Let's try the entire word. We have the B, okay, I and er. Let's try that. Beer, beer, beer. Our second word is beard. Now this word also has the I and E sound like beer and ear, but we add a D or D sound to the end. Basically it sounds like beer with a D. Beard, beard. Practice saying this, beard. Remember, so we make the B, ear, d, beard, beard. Now remember our tongue is rising just a little bit in our mouth for the i, e sound, beard, beer, beard. Don't forget that final consonant, d, beard, beard. Our next word, bear. So you can see by our vowel chart, the e sound is just below the i. So you have e, i, e. Your tongue is going to be resting low in the mouth and your lips are not as tense and you drop your jaw just a little bit. E. It rhymes with air, air. And we have the r at the end. So the b sound, b, b, e. Er, bear, bear, not beer, not the tense. Don't raise your tongue high in the mouth. Lower it, relax your lips, lower your jaw. Bear, and don't forget your R. Bear, bear. So let's start from the beginning. Beer, beard, bear. Our last word is bird. And again, if we look at our vowel chart, we are looking at the vowel sounds, the mid vowel sounds, uh. So you might recognize one of them as the schwa. And we also have another one. It just looks like an upside down V. This is also uh. 
and it they sound the same. It's just um, the schwa is for unstressed syllables. The other one, which is known as carrot, is for stressed sounds. And when we add the R to that, we get this symbol. So if you add this sound to the R, you have er. Okay, basically the R sound. Okay, so you're still going to curl your tongue. You know, don't tap the R, not R, D, or anything like that. Just curl the R, no contact on the roof of the mouth. Er. You might want to round the lips, push them out just a little bit. Er. So let's try all the letters together. We have B, B, Er, D, Bird. Don't forget your R, bird, bird. So do not tense your lips. You know, it's not beard, not, not, we don't widen the lips at all. Just er, push them out, round the lips. Bird, bird. All right, now let's try all four words slowly. We'll say each word twice. Number one, beer. Beer. Number two, beard. Add the D. Beard. Number three, bear. Bear. And number four, bird. Bird. Beer. Beard. Bear, bird. All right, very good. Practice these words again and again. And here's something fun you can do. Write these words down and then ask a friend to identify which word that they hear you say. So maybe choose one or two and then ask your friend to listen to you and say, you know, point to the words that I just said. Can they understand you if you say, bear or beer or bird and not beard and don't forget to add the final consonant duh to bird and beard so if you'd like more pronunciation practice check out my next video for the vowel diphthong ow happy learning everyone